Good evening to you, Kaidi. There will be no Sunday Masses here at St. Patrick's Cathedral or at any of the other churches throughout the Archdiocese as Cardinal Dolan walks through a political minefield of President Trump versus Governor Cuomo. We need to take our time because we have a high moral responsibility to protect the health of our people. Cardinal Timothy Dolan was very careful in choosing his words while visiting two Catholic Charities food programs on Staten Island. The Archbishop of New York complimented President Trump for wanting to open houses of worship immediately. I appreciate his sensitivity to acknowledging that the churches are essential services and need to gradually reopen. But the Cardinal also said he will follow Governor Cuomo's directive limiting faith services to 10 people or fewer and follow the CDC guidelines that masks and hand sanitizers must be used. We also need to be attentive to the health care precautions that have been wisely outlined by our professionals and by our elected officials. And so we know it's going to have to be done in a gradual, layered way. A decidedly slower approach than the president declared at an impromptu news conference Friday. If they don't do it, I will override the governors. Absolutely not. He has no authority under the Constitution. The director of the Center for Constitutional Rights says the Tenth Amendment makes it clear that President Trump is on thin ice here. The states have the full authority to regulate local matters, such as the openings of businesses and churches, and the president cannot override it under our system. And one leader in the Brooklyn Diocese says that churches will be reopening on Tuesday, but only for solitary prayer and not for masses. From St. Patrick's Cathedral in Midtown Manhattan, McGee Hickey, PIX11 News, back to you, Kitey.